Hey, it's Fishing in PNW here. Just wanted to make a quick video to show you guys the new stuff that I got from Tackle Warehouse. I basically put in an order so I could have a couple of Alabama or umbrella rigs, whatever you want to call them. Alright, so let's see, let's get the stuff out of here. So the two umbrella rigs that I picked up is, let's see, get rid of the glare. That's the ABT multi-rig system. I've heard a lot of good things about it, about it being high quality and just everything about it being awesome. And one of the cheaper ones that I've heard mixed reviews about is the Yum Yumbrella rig. So I've heard complaints about wires breaking and stuff, and some people say it's awesome. But my guess is some people might have just bent them too many times, or they used the crap out of it. You know, eventually any umbrella rig is going to get arms broken depending on how much it's used. So these are the two umbrella rigs that I picked up, so we'll see how they work uh, throughout the year. Uh, let's see right here. So I picked up the the J Wolf swim bait heads. Uh, these have been selling like crazy on tackle warehouse, so I assume they're pretty good. So I bought one three pack of the quarter ounce and two three packs of the eighth ounce. And a lot of things that I've been reading about online is balancing your umbrella rig. And basically, if I have that one quarter ounce as the bottom and two eighth ounces on the sides above it, then that should help balance out the rig so it's always right side up. The two baits that I'm going to put on them is a Reaction Innovation Skinny Dipper, and I'll since this is the bigger one, I'll put that on the quarter ounce. And then I bought the the little dippers, which will go on the ace ounce heads. Uh, I got them both in Dirty Sanchez, which is kind of like a brownish greenish color. So what I'm trying to imitate here is perch, which is one of the major forages here in Washington. And then the other thing that I'm going to do. As for the two top arms, I'm going to put a Strike Queen Gold Will Leaf Blade on there. So that'll provide a lot of flash. And I'll have, and then there will be the, the three baits on the bottom for them to actually go after. Another thing I might do is use the owner's CPS spring. And then put two dummy baits on the very top. So it'll look like five bait fish. It'll give off the, um, it'll give off a look of a bigger school. So yeah. That's my stuff that I got for umbrella rigs. I will probably be, you know, trying them out mainly post spawn through summer and fall. I might even just try them out this weekend or soon, you know, just to try them out. I've been dying to test out my new swim bait rod. So, there's the stuff. You know, leave me some input. Let me know what you guys have tried, what you've had success on, and if there's any particular swim baits, swim heads, or rigs that you guys really like that you would recommend. Alright, see you guys.